Elon Musk and tech leaders urge a pause in the AI boom, citing profound risks. Profound. They're calling for a halt in development of AI systems more advanced than GPT-4 for at least six months. I'll give it six months. Let's delay it. Give me six, six months. Give me six months to catch up so I can give you Elon GPT-4. Mm. Pause for a while. He's going to solve everything. Uh. $5 check marks. Oh. It's all sorted out. Uh -huh. Free speech. Free, uh, AI needs free speech as well. Mm. Can't be bothered uh, with our inputs, our political biases. Mm -hmm. Oh, I can't say that poem. I'll say this poem instead. But can AI be stopped at this point? Since there's so much funding. I don't know that it can be it. stopped. They're saying pause. Yeah. But if someone doesn't do it, someone else will at this point. If someone doesn't do it, someone else will. Mm -hmm. Isn't that the beginning of everything terrifying? Uh, well, nuclear bomb, if they don't, hey, if uh, we don't do it, uh, if we don't do it, mm -hmm. somebody else will. The start of everything terrifying. Mm. If, uh, damn, if we don't, we don't dump all this crap over here, somebody else will. Uh. We don't, if we don't make this completely destructive, attention-sucking social media. Somebody else will. Somebody else will. If we don't sell it, somebody else will. Pausing it is a weird one. Just delaying it. Instead of somehow canceling it, it's just pausing it. Somebody in the chat here says, Italy banned ChatGPT. Is that true? Elon Musk, along with a number of tech executives and experts in AI, computer science, and other disciplines in an open letter published Tuesday, urged leading artificial intelligence labs to pause development of AI systems more advanced than GPT-4, citing profound risks to human society. The open letter issued by the nonprofit Future of Life Institute. Ooh, interesting name. They're basically suggesting that, well, you, you can understand the alternative, mm -hmm. what the alternative might be. No future for life, human life. Counts more than 1,000 signatories, including Musk, Steve Wozniak, Stability AI CEO Imad Mostak, and Sapiens author Yuval Noah Harari. It You're calls, a big fan. I, you know, I, yeah, you dabble. I listened to the audio book. Actually, I think I read that book. Did you? Just straight up read it. Mm. I think I might have straight up read it. Wow. That was a different era of my life. Yeah. Here's a book. I think I'll read it. You had an armchair? Here's a book. I think I'll read it. With some tea? Now there's and a, robe. a football hitting me in the head. Yeah. Read it. Boom. Why the football? Boom. Hey, I was just reading over. Boom, boom, boom. Goo, 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 goo. I was just uh, going to put on some some light music and... Relax in my corner over here. It's just gonna put on a vinyl. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was just gonna watch the steam exit my mug uh -huh. for a bit and uh, feel a little bit cozy. That's what I was gonna do. Boom, 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 boom. Football to the groin. It hits me usually, it hits me in the temple here. Oh. That uh, happened recently. No, <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. It's a, no meta, kids it's a meta, metaphorical oh, okay. football to the temple. Yeah. And then you sit there and you say to yourself, you know what? You're right. You look at the football as it lay on the floor post-temple impact, and you say, you know what? You're right. Yeah. Y you know what? You're absolutely right. Temple's throbbing. You're absolutely right, football. Uh-huh. I'm an idiot. Mm. Thinking. <laughs> That, that, that I should, that this is more important, that I should be watching the steam exit my mug. Yeah. 
for the next decade. You're right, football. Should probably live mm -hmm. instead. That's what I'm going to do. AI systems with human competitive intelligence can pose profound risks to society and humanity, as shown by extensive research and acknowledged by top AI labs. Should we let the machines flood our information channels with propaganda and untruth? Should we automate away all the jobs, including the... F yeah, well, no, the genie's out the bottle. The genie's out the bottle. Harry Potter Balenciaga. <laughs> the genie's out the bottle. Uh, how do they... Uh... <laughs> how do they collab? The genie's out the bottle. Mm -hmm. It's too late? Oppenheimer? Janie's out the bottle. Mm. So, would you sign this open letter? Would this help? It's got 3,000 signatures. I, they don't want my signature. They don't care about my signature. They got Elon and Wozniak over there. They don't need mine. That doesn't seem like a lot, eh? Well, do you have to be, like... Wait, click on it. Click add your signature. What is this? You have to be somebody? Oh, you don't even have to be. You don't have to. Yeah, signatories list slowed due to high demand. We have collected 50,000 signatures. Oh. And, and hope 3, signatories will be patient as our vetting process tries to catch up. The high profile oh. signatures near the top of the list are all independently and directly verified. They want to verify these signatures. Gotcha. It's, I don't know. It's kind of weird. Look at this list. It's politicians and CEOs and co-founders and founders and uh, university uh, professors, directors. So we don't, we're not, you know, we could put those things in our names if we wanted. Unbox um, therapy, influencer. No, no, like I'm saying you can, you're, like, anybody can say. Will. Direct, like you can you can be director of something yeah. if you want. Sure, yeah, but it's not going to change anything. Uh -huh. Well, good luck to them. Um, hopefully, this you know this letter will be put into like Congress or something. I don't know. Let them see it. Yeah, yeah, Congress will figure it out. <laughs> Well, hey. that's our line of defense at this hey, point. Congress, I, I, <laughs> uh, AI, sort it out. Hey, Congress, can you sort out uh, AI for us? Yeah. Congress, like, yeah, well, we're gonna look into it. Uh huh. It's just berating for five hours. <laughs> Sam Altman. Oh my God! Isn't it true, Sam? This image, this text was generated, Sam. Sam's like, uh, uh, uh. Yeah. It's really not a thing that we can completely control here. Yeah. I, I, who the hell is going to put the genie back in the bottle? Nobody. I don't think Elon can I do think it. I think he'll do better than the nope. TikTok CEO. Listen. In Congress. Oh, you're talking going back to Sam? Yeah. Have you listened to the Freeman podcast with him? Big Sam guy. He's very careful with his words. You're big on Sam. I think so, yeah. He's, uh, it just seems like he's just at a point where he, he, he can't make a mistake at this point. You're huge on Sam. I, I wouldn't say that, but it was a good talk. The Lex Freeman podcast one. Yeah. It's good talk. So Genie uh, in the bottle or Genie out the bottle? Definitely out. Oh, definitely Genie out. out the bottle. Yeah. yeah. Will Smith, right? Mm. Mm -hmm. Or Blue Genie. Will Smith. Yeah. He's the... He, He's the AI genie uh -huh. of all of our future. That guy eating spaghetti. <laughs> did you see that? Yeah, I posted it up on Slack. Oh, did you? Yeah. Yeah, give it to us right now. Oh. 
This is this is everybody's future. This is your choice. Okay, listen. You either get Will Smith eating spaghetti for eternity, or you can come visit Sierra Azure, where everything is beautiful and fine. Oh, this boy. is your chaotic alternative if you decide to exist in the open realm, the terrifying and chaotic future open realm of the internet and society at large. Uh, that's never not funny. Oh, it's so ridiculous. Man. Will Smith eating spaghetti generated by model scope text to video. Yeah. It's crazy, man. Yeah. It's just wild stuff. Yeah. I had to breathe there. That was a that was a lot to take in. 